Oh, the light. So today, guys, I am going out to buy a new camera and probably a new oh, chair because apparently my back hurts from my chair. And I am taking my mom with me. Hello. Hi, pretty. See you later. Bye. Hi, mom. Where are we going? I don't know. Camera house? Camera house. Where's camera house? Third floor. Third floor? How do you know? I know. There's a lot of people. Oh no! Cyber oh. Vlog. Oh my, there are some attachments there, man. Na parang kasi ito kasi di ba? Okay, ako yung video for na. Happy ka ba? Para sa you too eh. Yeah. <laughs> Where do you think we're gonna eat today? So it's time to talk about the camera that I bought. I'm really excited to share it with you guys because this is the first camera I bought with my own money. My first camera was a DSLR. It was a 700D, a gift to me by my mom when I turned 18. So 18, 18 20, 21. 22, 23, 24. It's uh, six years after I got to buy my own camera. I think it's a dream come true. I mean, it's it took me a lot of years, but here we are. Guys, I bought the G7X uh, Mark III. Let's open the box. So, by the way, guys, I got freebies. So, apart from the free memory card, I got this HG100. This is a handy tripod with remote control. I am just disappointed about the HG100 because you can control it when you're in photo mode. It disappoints me because I would love to do self-portrait but without it, I'm not sure. Uh, maybe I'll just control it via my phone. I still need to connect my phone to the camera. And from my experience based on using the 800D of my company in 2019, um, I guess it's not really a, a convenient way to connect your or to control your camera through the phone because it took time for me to connect. Let's take a quick look. It looks so cool because um, it makes me feel like I have an uh, I have a not really Osmo pocket but like the DJI stuff and the remote is here so you can use it to zoom in and out and capture and stuff and it's battery operated but the battery is not really uncommon you can usually see it in watches 
and also it has um, a marathon watch from Timex here because it doesn't look like my style so I'll probably give this as a gift Christmas is coming okay guys look so here's the receipt wasn't able to take that out then the manual Okay. Comes with the battery, of course, the charger, the cord, and the device itself, the unit. I was actually expecting um, like the next strap, but they only gave me this. I'm gonna pop the battery in. Here. By the way, guys, the free memory card is already inside. I didn't take it out when the staff. Um, to get in but then I'll just oops okay there you go I'm so excited okay let's turn this thing on so we can see more what's inside okay there you go guys so I'll just have to um, change the date and stuff filming remotely secure the camera as with a tripod okay there's just a bit of manuals by the way guys this is I'm sorry. By the way guys, you can this is touch screen. Basically everything I saw from the DSLR is here except the night mode, so I guess this is a good um, thing. The aperture has its own scroll, so I like it. And it has built-in filters, which is fun. Right? My favorite okay, let's go to manual mode. And of course, the video mode, which is going to be my favorite because I'm going to be using it for um, vlogs, of course. And I want to show you guys also the flash. Here, you just have to pull this thing here. Boom! Cool. Look at that. So cute. Um, yeah, I'll also do, uh, use this for probably street photography or, I don't know, just basically... Um, taking photos for Instagram, I would definitely enjoy that. Did you see it? Oh god. I am also surprised about the zoom mechanism. Because I was used to using this thingy here when I'm trying to focus on, on the subject. But here you use it for basically controlling um, shutter speed, aperture, and zooming of course when you are on video mode. But not really. It's still for shutter speed and aperture and stuff. It has 4K feature. The difference between G7X Mark III and the G5X, I was on the verge of getting the G5X. I decided not to take it because it doesn't have like um, an output for external microphone. I think it prioritizes photography and it also has a viewfinder so I guess it just makes sense. Remote live view shooting. Okay. 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 Amazing. I love it. Oops. There you go, I love it. Feels like my GoPro app. Okay, there, it's connected already. So there you have it, guys. I can't wait to use it for my future vlogs and because I just want to give more quality to my vlogs and I just want to um, like step up the game. So I decided to buy this one. And this has been a dream of mine since 2016 and I'm so glad I finally have it. I can't fight the sound I hit 
solid ground. There you have it, guys. I now have a very comfortable work chair. Focus on me. I've always had back pain, but now it feels nicer, I guess. Or that's what I think, because I bought this for a price.